My name is Marissa Perez. I'm 18 years old and I'm with Say Word LA. During PE class, I was followed and catcalled by a man old enough to be my father. When I told my teacher, he said, it's not his fault you have the body that you do. During theater class, my teacher handed me a knife to cut stage tape and warned, be careful, this isn't Friday night in the Perez home. During sex ed, my school hired a speaker to talk to us. He said, boys, don't go ruining girls by having sex with them. That's something a woman gives a man on her wedding night. I mean, would you drink a soda that's already been opened and drank from? On my way to class, my dean stopped me, told me not to wear that outfit again because studies were conducted that showed boys couldn't focus in school anymore because of the way girls were dressing. When I told my counselor I wanted to kill myself, she sent me to the school therapist who said, you're dressed very nice. You don't really look depressed. How are we supposed to focus when we have to defend our existence? You want us to learn the curriculum, but the shit you taught us is, my shoulders are more criminal than sexual assaults. My race is a punchline and not thousands of years of survival, culture, and history. And the most important thing I can give my husband is not my intelligence, strength, or support, but a social construct called virginity. You want me to learn Pythagorean theorem, hire teachers that know basic human decency. You want advanced test scores, but won't make a safe space for kids to learn. We'll erase 90% of your students' history, then expect us to admire white men who owned our ancestors, bury bits of our identity every day just to get by, never using slang in front of our teachers for fear of being written off. It doesn't matter how much I fight to prove myself, I'm still accused of plagiarizing every one of my essays. How am I supposed to bubble in these answers when I'm too busy holding this shield? How can I get perfect attendance when dopamine drops keep me tied to my bed? I asked for help, but I was pushed away. How am I supposed to believe in a school system that doesn't believe in me?